friends, this is Thaddeus from Going Nerdy, and I am broadcasting live from the planet moon, sorry, forest moon of Endor. Uh, my clones and I are out hunting the elusive Ewok killer, the Gorax. It just came to me that there was some data mined information from the, from the devs in the most recent update, or the most recent, I don't know, some information was stolen from rebel sources. Many Bothans had to die to get this information to us. Now, one of the things that, that this little piece of information tells us, it, it just simply says, a new pack is coming. Now, as I've been thinking about that, I, I, I think a lot of people are focusing the new pack on the idea that a, a we, uh, we have some some new galactic legends that are going to be introduced. Now, with these galactic legends, some new stuff is coming. Now, this is going to be awesome. I think it's going to be really cool. I think it's going to be really exciting. Galactic legends, fun, right? You've got Jedi Master Luke and you've got the Sith Emperor, right? Or as I like to call them, Force Ghost Luke and, you know, Sith Zombie. But as I was thinking about whether or not these two characters could potentially be uh, this, this new pack could potentially be connected to these new galactic legends. I have to say that I don't think that they necessarily are. Because if you look at the characters that we currently have for the, these, you know, the information that we have about how to get these new uh, galactic legends, you have Sith Eternal Emperor, right? You, but with that, you are given this new marquee event in the form of Admiral Piet. Right now, Piet's pretty cool. He, he seems like a good character, and and he's when he's going to be farmable. Yeah, it'll be awesome. If I I thought for a pretty long time, I was like, all right, well, who's going to be the the Piet for Jedi Master Luke? And the answer is, we already got the Piet for Jedi Master Luke, and that is three PO Chewy, or two PO, or three P A, three Baka. I don't know how we what we decided on here, but we've got this character. We've got the the new. Uh, the new marquee event for Galactic Legends. So the real question is: this new pack, who who is it? Who is it? And what's it going to be for? Now the answer is the Mandalorian. A new pack for the Mandalorian coming out right now would give us something to farm towards, something to to hope for in the form of a legendary event, hero's journey, sometime. I don't know, sometime in the December area? And if that's the case, who is going to be our our character that we're going to need to have? My thought is we're going to need a light side character who helps the Mandalorian on his journey, right? And that is, I think we are going to get, either in this pack release, or quite possibly in sometime in the near future, the Armorer. Now, this is an interesting concept, because if you look at what the Armorer is, I, I think she's a great character. She had she could have a lot of potential. And she could introduce the Mandalorian tag, which, let's face it, a lot of us have been wanting for a very, very long time. Uh, she'd be pretty freaking awesome. And if you look at the Season 1 of of the Mandalorian as a hero's journey, she is crucial to helping him become the man that he is. The bounty hunter, the Mandalorian that Din Djarin actually becomes. And I think having her added to this game would make a lot of sense at this time. Now, there are a lot of potential characters. There's a lot of really cool characters that I think would be awesome to come uh, to be added to this game in the form of Mandal, in the form of marquee events. But, if we already have the the characters, the marquee characters that we need to farm for these other galactic legends, it would also make sense that we get something else in the form of a, a future launch, right? I think that's the case, but what do you guys think? Leave a comment in the section below. Let me know what you guys think. Like, subscribe, share this video in the section below. Ladies and gentlemen, are two very important links. First. The first is to a free trial for Audible. If you haven't signed up already, please do so. Thrawn Ascendancy Chaos Rising is out, and it is amazing. I have the physical hardback book, and I have the audiobook. It is, it's 
it's wonderful. Uh, trailer to come or, or more content to come on that. But additionally, you can get any books. If you sign up for it's it's a free, you get two books, sign up for one month. You don't pay a dime. You decide you don't want to continue the service. You keep the books. It's pretty win-win for everyone. Additionally, check out the Going Nerdy Swag Store. You get masks, uh, all kinds of really cool stuff. But again, finally, guys, leave a comment in the section below and let me know what you think. Are we going to be getting the armor? I think so. But tell me what you think. This has been Thaddeus from Going Nerdy. And as always, my friends, smile and stay nerdy. Thank you.